my typewriter out the window? Motherfucker. Why? Oh, shit. Um, I'll let the Forest Service know what happened. Turn up. Close that. Uh, can I read that? Okay, I put in a call. Oh, wait. Okay, thanks. Do you have any idea who would have done this? Maybe that guy I saw in the canyon, but I don't know why the fuck he'd want to mess with my stuff. Well, I'll have the rangers keep an eye out for a man hiking on his own and question him if they find him. <sighs> I can't believe someone would do this. I worry about bears and fires, and that's about it. And now I've got to worry about some deranged hiker going after lookouts? Great. Uh, okay, in the morning I'm going to call my friend Patty, who works the desk down in Cody. They keep a list of everyone who's officially been in and out of the trailhead since forever and see if we can get a list of names we won't get much but at least if anything else happens we can refer to it and see if anything comes up thanks i need you to feel safe out here don't worry about it oh you can protect yourself huh i've done it before okay tough guy <laughs> day two Okay. This is now the fourth episode. Ah, yeah, I am very much enjoying this. I actually don't know what channel I'm going to put this up on. Wake up. Oh, I'm freezing. Obviously, yeah. Hey, wake up. I'm awake. I'm awake. What's your problem? Our problem. Good first day. Sorry, our problem. That storm knocked out the phone line I used to talk to the service, which means we're cut off. I tried radioing out, and that's not working either. I don't really know why that would be the case. Can I go fix it? can't, but what you can do is hike out to where the wire runs mm. through your area and report back if it's down. Then I can track down a ranger to get someone on it. Okay, I can do that. Where is it? Remember that cave you hiked through yesterday? Yeah, of course. So you're going to want to go back there, go through it, and keep going straight to the north when you come out. Will do. Thanks, Hank. It's Henry. What, you don't like Hank? Yeah, I don't like Hank. But thanks rhymes with Hank. Mm, no, it doesn't. Okay, all right. <laughs> all right, let's go. All right, so I actually can't remember what happens here. Anyway, I just want to read as much, like, listen to all as much of the audio cues as possible. That's what I want to hear, really. Uh, where do I need to go? North of... Oh, yeah, i got to go back, don't, don't I? Uh, so... Uh, no. we got to go this way, haven't we? Yeah, I think we got to go back this way. Okay. Uh... Duh, 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 duh. we got to go, uh... North of the canyon. Um, why am I shaking? Wait, is it on there? Survey communication lines. I don't know. I think we go, I just go around there. Damn, I'm shaking. There's a High distance to just be fine when you land, isn't it? Oh well. Let's keep going. We go this way now. Um.
I hope I'm going the right way. I really do. I don't really have a good sense of direction. get used to it. It's been a bit of a night owl for a long time now. Oh, it's fine. I mean, fires don't really start until 11 a.m. or so. <laughs> Seriously? No. Good lord. I thought maybe it was one of those things like how earthquakes only happen at sunrise and sunset. Oh, uh, that's not true either, Henry. Jeez, we're really letting anyone in these days. Hmm. Okay, yeah, I really don't know if I'm going the right way. I don't know if I go. I have to go back down and then different direction. Hmm. I guess. Uh, ooh, trial and error. I really hope I haven't gone the wrong way. Oh, it's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are cold in Boulder, though, right? Yeah, they are. Uh, you know, uh, I don't know. We used to just spend a lot of time with our dog, Bucket. Aw, that's a good name. He was a good dog. What type? A beagle. We got him from the pound. That's great. Hey, can you hold on a sec? Uh, sure. I'm just gonna keep hiking and hoping it warms up. Hey, oh. I don't think so. Why, have you? Hey, your no, button is still down. Delilah, I can hear you. I'm absolutely sure. I said I could... Would but you? Are you talking about me? All right. Who are you talking I'll to? i let you know if anything changes in that regard. Hey, Delilah. Hey, sorry about that. Anyway, Bucket's a cute name. You, um, you owned him with someone? Who was that? I don't think he has any idea. What what was that? Were you talking about me? Uh, what? You left your button pressed or something. Henry, that call was work. I was just talking to... Actually, it's not really your business. Why are you freaking out? I'm not freaking out. Good. I'm gonna go quiet for a little bit. Call me if it's important. Hmm. Well, I would ask for a call, uh, well, about the call in my life. I would want to know. I mean, it might make me seem paranoid, but yeah. So I guess I was going the right way. That's good to know, because I would have felt very stupid if I had gone the wrong way. Yeah, this is the way that we got to follow. I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. Alright, so we just gotta keep following this. Uh, what was that audio? What was that cue? Okay. Wait. Pardon me. Let's keep going. See if we can get that audio cue again. Can you see the communication wires from where you are? I can see the poles, but I have no idea if the wire is in good shape or not. They run a good distance up to a spot called Beartooth Point. And you just need to walk along them all the way up there and make sure everything's in ship shape. Alright, uh, let's walk down here. Uh, here, I think we can go, yeah. I believe there's a cache around here. We'll keep following that. It's up there, I believe. Yeah. Hmm. 
The audio cues? No, nothing at the moment. There's a cache over there. Uh, don't know if we can actually go up there. Voice crack. Yeah, voice crack. No, we can't go up there just yet. So let's just walk around here. Is it? No. I'm going all the wrong ways. <laughs> oh. Guess what? What is it? There's a bunch of empty cans up here. Same as before. Yep. These fucking kids. Why do you think they'd be up here? Hell if I know, but they better have stayed away from our communication stuff. Yeah. Long drop. Oh, I didn't realize it was a long, long drop down. Right. Wait. Really? Well, I hopped down a drop, and now I can't oh. climb back up. Mm, that is a pickle. I can just keep hiking, but I figured I should let you know in case I get myself trapped out here. Mm, how adventurous of you. Mm -hmm. I've been doing a lot more climbing out here than I expected. Yeah. Well, keep your radio charged. I'd hate to one day find a skeleton with an orange backpack at the bottom of a ravine. <sighs> How do you know what color my backpack is? Damn. So we really can't reach anyone any other way than these wires? What else do you suggest? Smoke signals? Just seems dangerous. Well, if they don't hear from me for a few days, they'll send someone out, but I'd rather it not cover that. Wait, why are these... What are these beer cans inside the rocks? Uh, are they meant to be out here, but the code is throwing it off? Oh, there's rolling, rolling. Oh, it's flowing. Da -da -da -da. Illuminati confirmed. Illuminati confirmed. Oh. I guess we can't pick up those two beer cans. They're, uh, they've made themselves invincible. Invincible. <laughs> Almost there. Wait, what? Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. The wires down here. Okay. Good. Any sign of those girls? Did they mess with anything? I'll look around. Inspect the wire communication. Hey. So the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah. The thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut. Deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. <sighs> These idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you yeah. want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is legal. Oh, let's hear it. Oh yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air. I just want to inspect our way a minute. I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheep. Hmm, I don't know. Um, wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am gonna need a raise. Yep. By hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Gotcha. Well, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Okay. I think we should be able to, uh, you. Hmm. I wonder why I can't get up there. Anyway, guess we can't do it. Usually we could. Uh, but oh, more beer cans, curses. Yeah, I see a beer can over here. Can I pick it up. Yep, let's go the wrong way. So many beer cans. How, how 